Okay, hi, my name is Lauren. I'm here for a makeup tutorial. I know I've done this before, so. Alright, I just got out of the shower and I already did moisturizer. I'm just going to use these two serums together. They're really good. For priming. Okay, once that dries, I'm going to use um, just a little bit of for pore min minimizing. There's a lot that I like. I like um, the Smashbox one. Can't open it, it's a new one. Um, I like the, what is another one? The professional one's really good too. There's also a lot of moisturizing ones I like too. Just like where the pores are. This is the first video I've ever done ever. My face is like, doesn't look that great <laughs> today, but it's okay. Okay, and today. I usually don't wear foundation, more like a mineral foundation, but I'm going to use the Infallible Pro Glow with, uh, you know, the, um, this by Real Techniques. I had a beauty blender, but my dog ate it for anybody who knows peaches. And you know what? I usually do my eyes first. But I guess today that's not what I'm going to do. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's not what I'm going to do. I like a light coverage. I don't really like. But with a concealer, that will help too. Earth, cause I've never done this before. I have a little bit of redness in my nose, so I'm just gonna um, use Soap and Glory. Just get rid of a bit of that around the nose, just a little bit before I add more. Um, sorry, before I add more foundation. This is maybe only the second time I use this foundation. But um, my sister uses the Pro Matte, which I like a lot that too. But um, I like that a lot too. I mean, but um, I don't know where that one is actually. I have so much makeup; it's absurd. <laughs> but I actually have more um, skin, more skin care than I do makeup, which is a lot. This is really light coverage. I don't want nothing. Well, before I do my lips, I'm going to use the um, sugar lip balm. My lips are a little bit chapped. Okay, now to conceal. You know, there's a lot. I love concealers. There's a lot. Um, NARS is good. I'm going to use the Radiant Glow Concealer. I know number seven, but first I'm just gonna use this just right here and maybe on the eyes instead of eye primer because I usually do use Lorac or Too Faced eye primer or Milani for drugstores, really, really good. This is the first time I've ever done anything, ever recorded anything, especially myself. I'm low maintenance. I'm a mom. I have two young boys. Just turned six and eight. Uh -huh. Oh, and my name is Lauren. If anybody probably knows me. 
but I've always, I love makeup, um, gurus always have. Okay. And just to set my face, I actually like this a lot. Um, what's her name? One beauty YouTuber, I'm going to use the light, a really light brush. Beauty YouTuber loves this. Physicians from a youth, youth physicians from the youth, youthful wear. Just to set everything before, before I go on with um, because for now I'm going to be using um powder products for my eyes and contour and stuff. I didn't set my eyes. I usually do much more better, more stuff, but I'm kind of nervous because I don't do this. So that's just. Okay. For the eyes today, I'm going to use the Tartlet and Bloom. I love it. I know it's not, I know they have newer ones out, but this I just love. Alright, to set the whole eye. I know I just said it, but like to add more, I like it really, really bright before I put anything down. I'm using Flower Child, which is a light cream color. Because I do have a lot of discoloration, more so on my eyelid, like vein wise. And for the crease color, I'm going to use. Smarty Pants. It's like a light warm brown. I usually probably take a little bit longer, but I don't want to make a long video because I don't know how to, um, you know, edit yet. But hopefully I'll learn. I just out of nowhere decided to do this because I've always wanted to. My lighting's really bad, but once I get more involved into this, I'll make sure everything's good. Just a windshield wiper of motion. I usually use a more fluffy brush, but I'm trying to keep it low. And then I'm going to go up to Jet Setter, just for the, um, like the, the, um, outside. Outer V, below that crease. I'm not a makeup artist. <laughs> I learned off YouTube. I don't know everything. I just do whatever I prefer. Usually I try to do a better job than I am now, but I'm just trying to hurry up. And for the lid, let's do a sparkly color. So I'll add some. Some of that, so this some of the con NARS concealer and the sparkles, you know, stick better. Okay. Now let's add the shimmery color. It's called Funny Girl. Better just a pad where you get more pigment. Here we go. And I can learn from everybody, so if anybody has any, you know, comment, I would love, I love meeting new females or whomever on, online about beauty and makeup and stuff. But I've always wanted to do this, and then finally somebody just said, just do it. So it's was part of my mom did it. Okay. Now, now, what do we do? What do we do? Okay. I'm just keeping the eyes more natural. You know, nothing to do my brows. My brows today, I usually, I have um, the Benham brow. Benefit brow, benefit. But I'm gonna use my um, where is it? 
my L'Oreal one. Oh, I brought it down here. And my dog wants to come in. Hold on one second. I have others I can do, but I didn't like it when I first used it, and as time went on, I ended up liking it, so. All right, I'm just going to use the Micro Brow by um, NYX. Sorry, my room's a mess. Let's use that. I'm doing just things all out of ordinary today. My dog was trying to come in. <laughs> I have a blue fawn pit. And she loves to get into my stuff. So I learned how to edit. I'm just trying to fly by the eyebrows because usually. I take a little bit more time on them. I don't like, like, I wish my eyebrows were more, um, you know, fuller and stuff, but work with what you got, right? Okay, that looks okay. And I'll clean up a little bit of brows. This is actually really good for that. Just for it to be more sharp. Stand out more. Well, I'll just do my finger, which I never do. But I can't find my brush. So sorry, I know that's like a big no-no, but I can't find my brush. Seems like everything looks better in person. Sorry, my husband's vacuuming downstairs. I don't know why my eyebrows so sad. Okay, now contour. As you can see, I love my Lorac that fell out. I usually use light shade. I, I like a lot of contour products. Um, like a lot of different ones. It's kind of hard to get to. I should have used my own um, chocolate soleil. But what you want to do? I love contouring. I'm not a pro at it. I usually, there's a lot of different ways I do it. But until I learn how to. lighting isn't too good in here so there's that and my favorite I love the butter bronzer which I know everyone loves that it's nothing new. I'm very fair I have my window open and my light one hmm <laughs> This is not great. I mean, okay, highlight and mascara, people, right? <laughs> Highlights. Um, use a little bit of benefit. High beam. And also, wow, this this is not very flattering. This lighting on my skin at all it makes it look very not so great. My skin is actually not that bad. I have freckles, but that's about it. I mean, but no one.
some skin perfect. And I like a really like more natural. I like many of different brushes that I'm out of right now. Can't find. So I use the e.l.f. illumination palette. I love this palette for highlighting. Okay, mascara. We're gonna go with the L'Oreal Voluminous Original. I usually don't wear. I haven't done my hair, got dressed or anything, so that's why I look a hot mess. But you no, know, I don't wear fake lashes very rarely. There's one kid. I don't even know where that is. <laughs> where the um, camera is in the thing. I love Tarte, I love Lorac, I love NYX, I love like, the lighting makes this side of my face looks a little bit different than the other one because like, outside light, inside light, not very great. Blush, I forgot blush, butter bronzer blush, really nice for I guess for light skin. And Plum Rose. I really like that a lot, actually. I like the Dallas blush from um, Benefit, too. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Lips. I right, the lip moisturizer is pretty much done. Uh, I like lining them with Toast from Maybelline. It's such a pretty color. I have a lot of favorite lip things. They're better one. Sorry. No, I talk. I just use an exfoliator on my lips from um, Milani. It's really good. And now I'm just Tardis Pro. I love their lip paints. I like Namaste, but that's like really, really light. So I'm just going to use, I think it's called Parte. It's a matte lip color. No baking today, no nothing extravagant. Maybe next time, whenever I get, figure this out. And um, I'll use a little bit of Too Faced Naked Dolly in the middle to kind of give it more dimension and lighten it up a little bit. I don't look good with dark lips. Here, let me close the um lines to help see better, maybe. Or maybe not. Never know. Oops. Okay, that's the finished look, and I promise I'll get better lighting. Well, this is my first ever. Okay, and my name is Wow, that's a mess. <laughs> Lauren, and please comment, subscribe, and thank you. See you next time.